channel today I am doing a styling video I um, am doing leopard print today so um, I did a little poll on my Instagram and I'm filming both festival and leopard print because sometimes it's like neck and neck so <laughs> I'm not sure if this will be first or festival so like make sure you keep your eyes peeled um, but yeah I always do like polls to decide like what I'm going to film next so make sure you guys are following me so that you can like have your say or if not, just like comment below if there's anything you want to see. Other ones that I have lined up are um, wedding outfit inspo is another one I want to do. Um, what were the other ones? Like golden goose trainers, my new shrimps handbag. If you didn't see it, it's in my weekly vlog, which I will link. Um, and yeah, so just like, or if there's anything that I've not said that you want to see. So make sure you like comment below and let me know what you want to see. Um, oh, and someone else requested wide leg trousers. So yeah, that one's on its way. Um, but yeah, so I did actually do a bonus look for this one, I did four because um, I was just going to do a top, um, some trousers and some shoes and then I got a dress too so I thought let's just do all four because these are my four leopard print pieces, quite frankly the only leopard print pieces that I own, I don't have loads of leopard print, I think that it's for me something that you like mix in, not something you go head to toe and I think that you have to be very careful about the different things that you pick that are leopard print. Um, so I'm going to show you each piece and like how I styled it will be like over as I always do. So if you haven't already I would love you to subscribe to my channel. I do three videos a week. I do, I wouldn't say two things, I've just recently started doing three. So oh I forgot to put my engagement ring back on after my fake tan. <gasps> I need to undo that. Um, so the first one I do is on a Tuesday, a weekly vlog and that goes up at 7pm. And then again 7pm on a Thursday I do a styling video like this and then on a Sunday at 7 p.m. I do like a miscellaneous video usually it's like a haul or a lookbook or um, like a trend video or favorites or something along those lines um, so yeah let me know if there's anything you want to see and make sure you tune in and don't forget to subscribe um, and yeah so I'm gonna get into it oh I'm gonna link everything featured below all the leopard pin pieces and also um like all things I style it with and then I also do a current signing blog post which I'll also link below which will be like um other ways to wear leopard print and like the best leopard print on the high street and the best leopard print on the high end um and kind of like a bit more info on my take on leopard print as a trend um because I don't like these videos to be too blabby so I just feel like this is showing the outfits and then I'll kind of like go really in on the trend on the blog post so yeah go and check that out if you want more info and um, before I get started I also just want to show you this top because it's insane I'm in love with it. I'm literally in love. Um, I literally just got it from Topshop, so I'll link this below too. Um, and I love it so much. So the first outfit that I styled was with a cami. I'll put a picture of the cami here because honestly, I don't know where it is. I can't find it, so I'm not showing you it. I'm just going to talk about it. Um, so the cami, I love a good cami. I actually did a video on styling camis, which I will link here, um, because I just think it's like the staple for any wardrobe. So easy. So. For me, because it's such a like simple basic, I thought it would be great to do a cami as a piece for the leopard print. I love leopard print with black jeans. I just think it looks really nice with blue jeans too, but to me, I just love leopard print and black jeans because I just feel like they go so well together because the leopard print usually has the black in it. So normally when I'm doing leopard print, I will wear black jeans and then I'll also add in cream. Um, so it kind of is like a really nice neutral colour palette. Here though, I decided to stick with the kind of like caramel tones of the leopard print and add in my amazing cardigan from um, Mum's Handmade. This is new and I love it so much and then I accessorised with my Balenciaga boots which are just like an all time favourite um, and yeah I really love this outfit. I definitely wear blue jeans, I'd wear the cream cardigan, I'd wear it with a denim jacket. I just think this cami is so perfect you could wear it with skirts, like there's so many different ways to wear it but I just thought this was a really good way to like just a really small bit of leopard print that you can see and it just kind of like fits it in quite perfectly. Is this video on an angle? Am I like at an angle? I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, anyway, so look number two, I have the piece here with me and I went for some trousers. So these trousers, I'll put a picture in of how I wore them. I think I styled them the same for the um, video as I did for an outfit. So I'll put the picture in of the outfit here, which was a bit of a cop out if I'm honest. But I just love this outfit so much and I know not everyone follows me on Instagram so I wanted to show you it. And also sometimes like on Instagram it's just a picture but it's good to show it like moving, how it fits and how it flows because on a picture you don't always get to see that. Um, so these are the trousers and they are 
not mega stretchy, but I got them in a size H um, and I'm an H10 and they fit perfectly. They're high waisted, they're super floaty and light. I might actually wear these on my flight tomorrow because I'm going on holiday. Um, so yeah, and they are like kind of, I don't know if you call it like a tapered, but they're like kind of baggy and then they go in at the ankle. Very flattering style. I don't have any pinched trousers that I like this. Um, and so I actually work with other stories and they let me pick an outfit every week, um, month and I picked this entire outfit, so the trousers, the top and the bag, because um, I thought they'd look really cute together and guess what they did. Um, but I love the fact that this has pockets because loads of trousers I've got don't um, and this is a really nice material too, like you're not going to see your pants, just very good well made pair of trousers and um, so I sell them with a really cute top which as I said I got from other stories and it's kind of like sheer but not too sheer. Um, it's got like a dobby print but it's like a, into the material if you know what I mean and then tie front so you could actually open it up and have it as like a little you could have it really cute with a little crop top actually it's like a little lightweight summer jacket and now I'm thinking I'll take that on holiday and wear it like that too um, and then I have this basket bag which is also from other stories and I love it so much and I thought like again as I said before I like to mix the neutrals and this is like the perfect neutral colour palette with the trousers you've got the straw which is like natural and then you've got the cream and then I added my Converse, which are new, and they are like high top Converse. Um, not high top, high platform, like my Supergas, but Converse. And I think they're so cool, and I feel like I want to like build up my collection of these, because I love them so much. So the final thing that I have that the leopard print that I wanted to show you are my Golden Goose trainers. I was not sure about getting these, because I'm not a big leopard print wearer. Um, so I have Golden Goose in the plain style, which I adore, and they are honestly the comfiest shoes in the world. And then I saw this pair on, there's a blog called, a French blogger called Audrey Lombard, um, who has them, and I love her style so much. She wears leopard print all the time, she's definitely who inspired me to buy these, and who inspired me to want to wear more leopard print. So if you want more inspo on how to wear leopard print, then make sure you go and check her out, I'll link her like Instagram below. Um, but yeah, I really love these. I'm so glad I got them because honestly, they go with everything. So for the like sake of the video, I just styled them with a really simple, like super simple casual outfit. I styled them with a pair of jeans, my all time favorite jeans. They're so comfortable and like just insane. I love them so much, they're so flattering. Um, and then also the top from the previous outfit, um, the other story is top because I just really like it and I think it went really well with this outfit. And then I can't remember what bag I put it with, but I know it would have been a cute one. I feel like I put it with my shrimps bag, or maybe I put it with a basket bag. I'm not sure, but I'm sure it looked really cute. You can see it here. <laughs> um, but yeah, I really like this outfit a lot. I wore these a lot as well in LA. They look really cool with like, I wore them with my black denim skirt and like just a really chilled out navy jumper or you can wear them with like cream again or I think they look cool with white jeans actually or um, I wear them with like summer dresses they just go with everything and they look so cool and another person who obsessed with golden goose and wears them all the time is Sincerely Jules and she has like all of the cool styles so yeah I actually just ordered another pair of these and then my final bonus look is the leopard print dress um, and I wanted to show you this because um, it's not something that I normally would go for, it was part of a collaboration and I saw it and I was like, do you know what, I actually love that. Um, and what I've done, so it's LK Bennett, um, so it's very amazing quality, it's like a really small leopard print in comparison to like this, which is super big, um, and it's kind of more of like a brownie, whereas this is more of a beige, um, but I love it so much, it's got like the sheer sleeves, oh, I'm still up from wearing it. Um, and like the long um, cuffs with the gold button detail which is beautiful and then you kind of pull it here which makes it go in so it's actually meant to be a bit longer like knee length but what I did was I tucked it under so it was like shorter which is definitely how I would wear it personally I way prefer, 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 I way prefer short dresses but what I love about it is that you can have it long um, because you could wear it longer for like a wedding or something or like a formal occasion. It's not like indecently short, but I do like it shorter. So I would like tuck it under and have it shorter. So I really like that you've got the option to do that because I think when it's a more expensive dress, it's nice that you have got the option because then you feel like you're gonna get way more wear out of it. Um, so again, like if I was going to a wedding or something, I just styled it with like a clutch and some heels, but I wasn't, so I styled it with, what did I style it with? I can't remember. I can't, 
So if I was going to a wedding, I would start with a clutch and some heels, but I wasn't, so I styled it. I think I put my shrimps bag or my basket bag, I can't remember, but I put my gold cowboy boots, which I am in love with. <laughs> like literally obsessed. Those cowboy boots are my life. I love them so much. And yeah, they look really cool with this. I loved the like style. I'd also style these with my Chloe boots, but I wanted to put in my gold cowboy boots because I just love them so much. I mean, I'd wear my Balenciaga ones too because they're like more bikery. I just think this would go with anything really. Um, or you could wear them with like summer sandals or like mules. I just think it's an all round classic dress. You can wear with anything. Um, but yeah, so those are my four looks. You got a little bonus one this week. Let me know what you think. Do you like them? Which one's your favourite? Do you prefer the dress, the shoes, the trousers, or the top? Have you got any ideas on how I could style these pieces? Have you got any other like great leopard print pieces that you've got that you think I should get or that other people would like? Do you have any tips on styling leopard print? Um, and if you haven't already, make sure you check out my blog post. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next week. And make sure you let me know what you want to see next. Do you want to see wedding guest outfits? Or do you want to see wide leg trousers or do you want to see how to style my new shrimps bag? Um, and yeah, I'll see you next time.